The matter earlier scheduled for hearing from the last sitting could not go on as scheduled on many grand as cancer to AGF. Enoch Simon prayed the court to vacate its earlier judgment, restraining the federal government from freezing the account of Sunday Igbo or further arrest of his allies, claiming such interim judgment can only stay for seven days. Cancel to the Yoruba activist Yomi Aliyu SAN objected, claiming that they had filed for extension on the 26th of August. Cancel to AGF and DSS claimed they were not served, but it was established that cancel to AGF was served on the 26th of August, while the cancel to DSS was served Monday morning before the sitting of court, but refused to acknowledge receiving it. Justice Ladino Akintola, however, adjourned the matter, noting that the five days for the cancel to respond from the 26th when the application was submitted and served will only expire Monday 30th. Counsel to Igbo, however, described the move as a lawyer's tactics to delay hearing. The AGF people did what we lawyers used to do. I mean, I'll call it legal acrobatic. They, they have the right to be heard within five days. And that is what they are asking for, five days. There are five days, I think, it lapsed today. So, they argued it, and the court adjourned till 7th September for hearing of the matter. He also called on DSS to stop flouting the Abuja High Court order regarding the bill of the 12 allies of Yoruba activists arrested during the raid to his Ibadan residence. When a court of law ordered that 12 people should be released and the DSS is sitting on that judgment, I, I think I made a press release and I reminded the leader of DSS that you should learn from Magu that if you, lay, if you think you are in authority today, tomorrow you may find yourself in the same trap you made for your enemy. And I will implore everybody that is in this government, as well as those who are senior advocates of Nigeria, they should not be partakers in the type of government that will not respect the order of the court. The case was adjourned till 7th of September for hearing Femi Amushon, AIT News, Ibadan.